take a look. I mean, whatever you can see, though. Yeah, but, uh, anyways, uh, happy Halloween, everybody. Yeah. It's already the end of October. I can't believe it. Times go by really fast. But anyways, I just wanted to make a quick vlog, you know, just everyone uh, be safe out there, you know, uh, if you have kids, small ones, or, you know, if you have cousins, uh, nieces, nephews, or, you know, like if you're taking care of a neighbor's kid or something, you know, when you take them out trick or treating, be careful. There's some stupid ass drivers out here, especially in Atlanta. And uh, don't regard the fact that I am like holding the camera and driving at the same time. I'm again, I'm very focused on uh, the road right now. I'm not really looking at the camera too much. But anyways, yeah, just uh, just wanted to point out that you know it is Halloween and it totally makes me miss my whole childhood. You know, the fact that for one day out of the whole year you can dress up be whatever you want to be and you get free candy you know how cool is that man I miss my childhood yeah but anyways you know I'm heading to class right now and after class I to see if I could run by the store and grab some candy real quick before the little ones come out and I wonder what uh what the coolest costume I'm gonna see I mean I better see something really far out though you know Superman Batman and after a while, it gets kind of old, so, or, you know, seeing a little princess or tiger, I mean, that's cute, but, you know, it's, uh, I gotta see something unique, you know, if I see, if I see a kid with some awesome, unique costume that I haven't seen before, I'm giving him extra candy just for that, but, uh, yeah, made me remind me one time, Halloween, I think it was 2000 or 2001, I mean, I was still in middle school, I was the uh, Grim Reaper, and uh, there was uh, it was a, it might have been an Indian summer because it was still really freaking hot outside, and I was wearing shorts. But anyways, uh, I went to a friend's neighborhood, and this neighborhood is really huge, and it's a neighborhood where there's a lot of kids. So you know, every house, you know, you're, there's gonna be uh, to get candy, of course, we see other groups of kids walking, you know, trick or treating as well. I get a pillow bag, you know, to put my candy in. By the end of the night, that thing not only did it almost rip completely, but it was just like so heavy that I remember not only having a hard time carrying it at the end of trick or treating, but the next day I was just so sore from carrying it and how heavy, uh, you know, the bag, because of how heavy it was, it might have been like, I don't know, 20, 25 pounds, and I was carrying that shit on my shoulders, too, you know, being 13, 14 years old at the time, you know, for me, <laughs> that, that was a lot, so, uh, yeah, but yeah, this time of year, just, it's a good time, you know, it's, uh, weather's nice, uh, traffic doesn't help too much, though, but, uh, that's whatever, but, uh, yeah, uh, good old Halloween. I miss it. I miss being a kid, you know, don't you? But yeah, you gotta be careful out there though with the crazy drivers and uh, pedophiles. Don't like if uh, if you're little, if you're like under 13 and you're watching this or whatever, be careful. Like if uh, some creepy old guys like yeah, kids, I I have some candy. Just just come on and be like. Uh, no, I'm gonna pass on that, <laughs> because, um, you never know what could happen, so, safe bet, you know, just, uh, go to houses that are lit up, uh, you know, look, look up both ways, you know, when you're crossing the street, you know, shit like that, though. Also, cops are gonna be out there, you know, they're gonna make sure everyone's safe, and, you know, no one's breaking the law, and of course, catching the drunk drivers, which, of course, Friends of mine, they're gonna want to party. Well, and tonight, go to some bars because the bars around here are always good on Monday nights. So, be like, hey, Monday night, Halloween, sweet. I get to dress up and drink. So, remember, guys, watch out. Cops will arrest you.
for drinking. If you drink a little or, or not, well, again, if you're over the limit, yeah, you'll be fucked. Anyway, that's all I gotta say, and, uh, talk to you later. Bye.